left off, we are dealing with the nasty and petty the QAU. And I kind of knew it from the start, I, and I fucking called it, and it's a good thing I did. So, uh, let's get back into it. Right! I'll do my best. You'd better. I use lips curls. I can't understand why Marina was so uh, damnant that I let you to take my photograph. Though, you've already had your chance and you blew it. What? Bitch, did you forget that you slapped me? And most importantly, you ran into me. D -d 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 dumb bitch. So she does remember our first meeting. I figured as much. My obnoxious big sister seems quite taken with you. She keeps telling me that you are a good, kind man with a delectable smell. I'll admit, your aroma is quite appealing. But you're no good looker. Everything about you, about your fashion sense, to your posture, to your style of speaking, is a huge turnoff. I mean... Your nasty attitude is more of a turnoff to me than it is to Hiroki, so I think it's safe to say I can't agree more, bitch. You're not attractive at all. Not a surprise. Why then is Marina giving you such a professional treatment? What in the world does she see in you? And why did I feel so hot during our first meeting? <laughs> she mumbles to the last question under her breath, more to herself than anybody else. I don't think she means for me to be overhearing her, but she's not she's not being particularly subtle. And I do all the same. How am I supposed to respond to that? Should I apologize? But Marina scolded me for apologizing too much. Maybe I should be more faith in myself. Uh, so, Mr. Q, is it alright if I start the photo shoot? I have my equipment with me. I'm ready to go whenever you are. Fine, fine. You waves one hand carelessly. Start snapping away, I don't care. The sooner we get this over with, the better. I couldn't agree more. A Q might be hot. Her tight swimsuit is struggling to contain her heft of her huge melons but her personality leaves something to be desired I wouldn't mind as much if she's just in vain or materialistic I've worked with more difficult clients than her before but her two-faced nature makes her more aggravating no shit she's nothing at all the adorable image she projects to her fans if they knew what her idol really thought of them, I doubt they would be willing to support her much longer. Showbiz is such a sketchy industry. No shit. I get my camera out of my bag and start adjusting the lens. I hold it to my face and zooming in to a used boxum face and then pause. Uh, Mr. Cute? Yes, what is it, cameraman? I was just wondering, uh... Do you really want me to take photos of you lying in a pool full of money? Oh, but of course. That's why I set this all up. I wouldn't have bothered if I had known you were coming. I don't like wasting time. Hey, you snorts. You're not very bright, are you? This barb makes me grit my teeth together. This girl is seriously annoying. No shit. Her moody Girls are bad enough, but her smug smirk of hers is even worse. I thought I showed the world just how incredible I really am. Doesn't matter what, if Cosmos has two million followers on Rabbit Pound and I do. I'm a real celebrity here. And I have more than enough cash to prove it. I won't let anybody look down on me, or mock me, or insult me. I might be an idol, but I've worked hard. I clawed my way to the top, and this is where I tend to stay. If money is power, I must be invincible. So what do you think? Are you impressed? You must be impressed. Why wouldn't you be impressed? <laughs> Bitch. 
felt a breath of sweat trickling down my cheek. I never would have thought of a star like a QAU, but she must have had a serious chip on her shoulder. I don't think you need to go such length to prove your worth. Everybody knows you're successful without f you flaunting your wealth like this. In fact, I think posing in a tub full of money would have made your fans turn against you. Pa, what do you know? A you turns her nose up in the air. In this world, money is everything. I have a lot of money, much more than Cosmos or even Marina. So, I must be a queen. My authority is unshakable. Bow down before me. I can't bow down right now. I'm supposed to be taking your photo. Then do it. Capture my booty. What did he say? Oh. Y'all didn't hear that. I'm editing that shit out. I swear to God. Editor, if you fucking keep that in, I will beat your ass. Shut up, bitch. Then do it. Capture my beauty. Right here and now. That's an order, peasant. So, I've been downgraded to a cameraman, to a peasant. What's next? Serve, slave? I'm pondering this when... A you jolts. Her eyes widen to com comical proportions. All of her smug self confidence is gone. Now she looks like a little girl embarrassed after being caught pilfering cookies. I gather my senses about me, a more difficult task than it sounds, and rush to AU's side in alarm. Are you alright? Did something happen? Yes, I, um, I wasn't paying attention in, well, shyly, Japanese number one idol holds up a finger to of her right hand to my inspection. Its tip swollen pink and has been bisect horizontally with a hairline cut. Uh, I know what it is, even before a use tearful confession. M Mr. Caravan Man? I think I have a paper cut. Good lord. Alright, that just about does it. I sighed, wiping a few pieces of sweat from my forearm, and then examined my handiwork. I managed to salvage most of my money from a used paddling pool. Now, all the crumpled, slight sweaty notes are stashed away safely inside my shoulder bag with the rest of my camera equipment. The pool itself, meanwhile, was deflated. I now lie under the shade of a palm tree, blasted and unused. A you herself hangs back, still clawed in her gold swimsuit, which by the way, love the scenery. She props her full breasts up with her arms and an embarrassed blush plays against her cheeks. Luckily for me, that paper cup wasn't enough to convince AU that her proposed photo shoot was a bad idea. With a bit more cursing, I got her to abandon the idea for good. I'm glad she's being taken care of, but the day wears on and I haven't taken a single photo of AU yet. This is shaping up to be a disaster. It's not like I'm glad you helped me tidy up or anything, idiot. Baka baka, like, bitch, please. I don't have time for that shit. You pouts the voids of her usual pumps and scoffs at a sand dunt with the tip of her foot. Truth be told, I found a you nothing short of irritating during our reunion. But her mishap earlier drained some of her cocky self-confidence. Now she's awkward and unsure of herself, she's significantly more manageable. She's more likable, too. Her mega cute stage persona might be an act to endure her fans, but maybe her mega bitch persona was an act to calculate to impress me. I'm not sure why a you go out of her way to impress me, given seems like she hates me. Uh, but that is really is the case. Then I guess I feel somewhat flattered. I was a bit less happy, however, 
about all the banknotes she crumpled and tore during her little performance piece. What a waste. I'm not happy with this at all, but since we're business partners, it'd be remiss of me if I didn't thank you. Marina will be pissed if she finds out that I've given you a hard time, so, uh... A.U. scratches her cheek, her brow furrowed. I'm happy to, to clear up all the money. I'm happy you treated my paper cut too. Thanks. Sure, she's acting nice now, but isn't it a little too late? I was about to say the same thing. I'm not sure how to feel about all this. Scold her for being thoughtless. <sighs> See, I want to scold her, but at the same time, it will get worse from here, so it's not a problem. Like I said, we're business partners. I'm just doing my job. I offer to you one of the big, brightest smiles. With her recoil, her eyes mean mistrustfully. I'm still pouting. Sure, whatever. I still think it would have been good if you took in some photos of me in that pool. Like I'd want it, but maybe it was too high concept for most normal people. I don't know if it was all that high concept, but it was a certainly a controversial concept. You think people wouldn't like it? With all my experience of a photographer, I can say categorically that they would not. Yeah. You take a step back defeated. I thought it was such a good idea too. <sighs> what does a girl have to do to get people to respect her? Your fans respect you more than enough as it is. Can't you remember how loud they cheered for you? Sure, they cheered for me, but they don't look up the same way as they look, people look up to Marina. My media doesn't see me as a role model or an inspiration. I think they just see some dumb kid who lucked into being a success overnight as if it was that easy. I worked hard to become a Japanese top idol. I sacrificed all my free time and I put in so much effort. And the general public refuses to recognize me. They say I'm nothing more than a fade or fod. They call my songs or vapid or meaningless, and they say I don't have any real talent. People online say I go after the lowest common denominator and I'm nothing more than bait for sad and lonely men. I wanted to use the photo shoot to get back at those naysayers. I wanted to make them see how far I've come and how amazingly wealthy I am. I figured if they saw my riches, they wouldn't dare criticize me again. Was I mistaken? That's a tricky question actually, yeah, that kind of is. I don't think it's bad that you wanted to be accepted by more people. That's natural. I don't think anybody likes being insulted. Apart from, like, uh, masochists. But that's part of being a public figure. You chose this life of scrutiny for yourself when you decided to become an idol. It's impossible to make everybody like you. You'll never be able to sway everybody's heart. You should focus on giving your existing fan base they want. And you don't think they want to see how much money I have? I think that's the opposite of what they want. I don't know much about idols culture, but I'm talk maybe I'm so maybe I'm talking about my ass, but I think your appeal as an idol comes not from the m monetary success, but how from how you treat your fans. I can remember what you said last week um, when I saw you live. You attribute your current success to your fans, and you thank them for their support. You make your fans feel loved and valued that's why i keep buying you out buying your albums and supporting your songs 
They think you're sweet, kind girl next door type. Please, work hard to cultivate their image. That's the A A U A U everyone knows and loves. <sighs> Hiroki. Ayu sniffs, blinking tears from her eyes, and then she offers me a bright smile. Thank you. I feel a lot better now. You're right, of course. I can't make everybody revere me, because I, but I don't need to. I'm already Japanese top idol. Thousands, no millions of fans all over the world, and they love me, even if other people don't. That's why I need to show them my unique AU AU brand of cute and captivating. I put on the lovely doubly spell on them, and they'll fall for me all over again. Yes, that's right. The photo shoot started poorly, but the youth speech is getting me fired up. She sure knows how to work a crowd. If you keep up that attitude, this photo shoot will be a huge success. I know it will. Well, of course, that goes without saying. I'm AU AU, and I'm the most popu popular idol in Japan for a reason. My fans love me, and I love them. I'll give them a super special service, so they look at me and only me. I monopolize their eyes, mind, and hearts. And who knows? Hey, you smile smugly, and her eyes plant on her lips. I might just steal your heart too, Mr. Cameraman. Oh, really? I like to see you try. You don't need to. I'm already halfway there. You're staring at my boobs for the last half hour. Mm, it's not like I wasn't. <laughs> what are you, some sort of kissless virgin? <laughs> uh, well, um. Now it's my turn to be embarrassed. I glance away from AU, unable to meet her knowing gaze. She's not wrong about that count. I have been gapping at her breast, but can you blame me? They're huge. Uh, yeah, I can't really blame them. I'm not gonna hold you, dog. <laughs> I've seen a lot of attractive women during my last week, but AU's no slouch. Her body is just as incredible as Marina's and Cosmo's. Huh, this is all too easy. You're such a simpleton, Mr. Cameraman. I'm a succubus, just like Marina and Cosmos. And I won't let them beat me. Alright, I'm gonna have to hold it here, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is so much going on. I'm gonna take a breather, and then I'm gonna come back to recording in a little bit, but... God damn, this, this, this has officially gotten me so bad. Uh, but yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys do, make sure to leave a like. Also, hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's been said. I'm out.